We are back at Outback RV in Texas, in Denton, Texas. OutbackRVTX.com is their website. And today we're going to be talking to Craig about the Taxa Outdoors Mantis. This is a new model for 2023, right? Does the 2023 2023 new model? Yep. So let's take a look around here. You said that this one was, they designed this one to your request well, or something? And, no, this one, well, it's, it's their Manus 5.1, but uh, we had the company do something that we think is really cool. Okay. And we added, uh, we had them add another 180 on, on the Duh, other side. On the other side, okay, yeah, okay. You know, camp on both sides instead of one. Right, uh, right. So it, it just gives you a little bit more options uh, with this particular uh, Mantis. Okay. So what we're really liking about these is there is, um, they're very utilitarian. Mm -hmm. uh, these, you can sleep for easily because uh, you have the bunks or the sofa option up front you have a bed in the back or two you have a built-in shower uh, you have that um, also turns into extra um, room for your plates and pots and pans and you have an enclosed toilet mm -hmm. a workstation over here on this uh, sofa slash bunk side mm -hmm. um, and then the back we have the eating area, and then that also drops down to the bed. Go back here and look. Yeah, so I figured that this turned into a bed, yep. and the front couch. My, uh, does it pull out some, or is it just a single bed the way the it's way it is a single now? Single bed. Okay. And then the okay. top will drop down for the back of the sofa. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So yeah. it's yeah. You could probably put a kid up there or something. So oh, yeah. two people here and one on each of those. Okay, I got you. Okay, good. But this is uh. This is certainly nice here. You know, I, I walked in there before we started here, and it almost, yeah, I've been watching a lot of van life videos on YouTube, and it almost looks like some of these, the way that some of these van life people decorate their vans that they live out of. Well, yeah, my <laughs> wife decorated this one, and uh, she, I think she did a pretty good job. I think she did too. It looks great. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, obviously, you'd have to move all this stuff before you hit the road, but, you know, that's not really the point. So, okay, let's go look at the inside. Yeah. Well, tell us about these. We were talking about these windows first. These acrylic. Oh, yeah, these are dual-paint acrylic. Yeah. The windows, um, super well insulated. They're very durable, very tough. Uh, they don't sweat, uh, which makes it really nice. Okay. Um, the exterior, this is actually, uh, this is actually uh, aluminum. Really? Yep. So, and it's uh, it's it's the it's, in, it's the insulated aluminum shell, and you can see the guy who designed this originally uh, mm -hmm. is a NASA uh, ex NASA engineer. Okay. Garrett, and uh, if you you can kind of tell by looking at the that the whole trailer that it has that uh, to me it looks like it looks uh, kind of aerodynamic, it, right? And it looks yeah. like space shuttle ish. Yeah. Know, yeah. Skeleton style. Sure. Yeah, we've got kind of a slight yep. slope down there. Okay. So there's uh, two 20 pound tanks. You can always upgrade these to 30 pound tanks. And sure. Have a ton of propane. Yeah. Uh, while you're while you're camping, the lock and roll hitch. Mm -hmm. This is the Overland model, so it's going to come with a lock and roll, and also it will have the uh, timber and suspension. Okay. Yeah. Uh, now. Good. This also comes with um, this the Truma heat and hot water. Okay. So it's a super efficient uh, heating system and hot water system. Okay. It's very quiet and it, they heat very, very well. And also the hot water is. Um, is this on? Because. Whoa. Yeah, that's a water pump. <laughs> that's a water yeah. pump. Okay, then. Yeah. I should so not touch are, things. Yeah, those are light switches. And okay. The Truma controller is right next to it. This right here? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Yeah, it's got the battery reading there. Battery on off switch inside, yeah. that's kind of neat. Yeah, that's nice. That's, uh, yeah, that's different. And, and as you can see, each uh, light switch or any kind of accessory switch has its own fuse. So these are your 12 volts. Okay. Which is, uh, you don't have to go digging down into the converter for them. Right here you're talking about. Yeah, and, yeah, okay. yeah, and over there. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, underneath here. And okay, then, yeah, okay, yeah, and then you'll there. have your 12 volt and mm -hmm. also uh, USB uh, outlets. Gotcha. Throughout. 
Gotcha. Now you said that the okay, this one's got a 110 air conditioner, but you're talking about putting a 12 volt on it. Yeah, we're talking Maybe on the about top it, here. Uh, in place of the uh, load bars in the back. Um, okay. We would oh put yeah. A, okay. We would hang okay. a 12 volt down in there and and with some like solar there. panels. Okay. Right. Right. 200 watts of solar and a 12 volt. And... This canvas is nice and thick up here. Yeah. And of course, those windows you said were super insulated. Yeah. So, so this is when you have all this up, uh -huh. have the air conditioner heat on. Uh huh. It it. The, the it acclimatizes really well. Good. Yeah. Good. Okay. Wow, this is neat. And this is a brand new 2023. I'm gonna I'm gonna hit my head on this again. 2023 model. You got it listed at 58650. Yep. And I didn't know this till you told me a minute ago. But the uh, taxes made in Houston. Yes. Okay. So the model is actually 5.2 Mantis 5.2. The dry weight's 3486 pounds. The length is nine. I forgot to ask that. The yeah, length is 19 overall. feet overall. Yeah. Wow. From tongue to bumper? Yes. Okay, including the tongue then. It's 19 feet overall. And then the ground clearance, we had to go look that up, but that's okay. It's 14 inches. So I assume it's 14 inches to that like ball joint there. Right. Okay. Good. Yeah, because these jacks will go up higher than that. So the, the low part is this guy right here. The suspension down there, which you, of course, want on a trailer like this. Oh, I didn't see this. It's another outlet right here. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Those are probably hidden all over the place, I assume. Yeah, there's going to be some in the back also. Yeah. Uh, the 20 gallon fresh water. Uh huh. Uh, is, is not, and then you have a 22 gallon gray water. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. 20 gallon fresh water in a trailer this size is pretty, pretty large, actually. Yeah. And, and with uh, two extra five liter jerry cans and your. Right. You're doing pretty good. Yeah, that's true. Cool. Okay. Uh, spare tire right there. What goes? Oh, so, are those for jerry cans? Yeah, so okay. these are all steps going up to access the load bars, but okay. these are also the width of the jerry can. Okay. And it already has the uh, built in strap or the, the places that you can strap them into. Right, okay. Good. Now there's a fresh, it looks like a fresh water tank there. How, how big is that? 22 gallons, I believe. And that's really good for a trailer this size. And solar? So, Zamp Solar, uh -huh. uh, 30 amp service. We have this into, into 110 and it runs everything just fine. Yeah, okay, uh, all right. The outside shower and mm -hmm. uh, quick connect. You can also put a shower tent outside if you want mm -hmm. or wash the dog, do clean fish, whatever you <laughs> want to do out there. Sure, yeah, okay, all right, good. Yeah, and then uh, this is your city water inlet. This is a, your Truma. Furnace output and okay. hot water output. Okay. And that looks like a gray water tank there. Right, it is. Okay, yeah. yeah. So no black water because it doesn't have a no, plumbed it's, toilet. Right, it's going to have your cassette yeah. toilet. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. The other side of the front. I really miss my, on my old trailer, I had the, the electric winch. Yeah. And I really miss the electric winch on my new one. But that's something you can add later, I guess, if you sure. want to. You want to. So yeah, and then these uh, these awnings here. You said they yeah. have they. These can, are twenty three zeros. Yeah. Uh, the wall uh, assemblies you can get online, or we can order them for you. Okay. But you could actually uh, it's like a competitor of uh, wood that we sell here. Okay. You can actually put the walls completely around this one, and uh, you, and have a great enclosed uh, area. Yeah. On both sides. Yeah. Yeah. Then it would be like a really big tent. With, yeah, uh, yeah. With uh, some cool stuff in the middle. So great. Well, once again, outbackrvtx.com. I have that right, don't I? Yes. Yeah, okay. Outbackrvtx.com is where we're at today. And go look this up. And uh, this is not the first Taxa Outdoors trailer that, uh, that's that been on the channel. I did the um, Tiger Moth here a while back. So that one's up on the channel now. You can go check that out. And I'll put a link up top. So uh, thanks for watching.